the Enterprise is five parsecs out of Rigel 12. Nothing's going on, neutral zone is quiet, the crew is bored, so they put on a pie-eating contest. The whole crew's in the galley. They're eating Tullaberry pies. Tullaberry? Tullaberries. From Gamma Quadrant, yo. That's Voyager, dude. Okay, blueberries, then. They're eating blueberry pies Better. as fast as the replicator can turn them out. Finally, it's down to just three. Kirk, Spock, and Chekhov. Okay, Spock always wins these things. How is Spock gonna beat Kirk, yo? Spock's like a toothbrush. Look at Kirk, he's got room to spare. Spock has total Vulcan control over his digestion. You wanna hear this or not? Yeah, yeah, go. Okay, finally, Kirk, he can't take it anymore. He yorks. Now it's just down to Chekhov and Spock. But Chekhov, you see, he's got a whole fat stack of quatloos riding on this. And he has figured out a way to win. He's got Scotty back in the transporter room, locked in on Chekhov's stomach. Every time Chekhov eats a pie, Scotty beams it right out of him. Where is he sending him? The toilet? Space! Oh. There's blueberries just floating out there, frozen because it's in space. And Chekhov is just shoveling them into his mouth. And, and Spock's like, I can't believe this Russian is defeating me. Meanwhile, Scotty's in the transporter room fiddling with levers when Lieutenant O'Hara comes in. And she's got, you know, her big pointies. And Scotty's fingers are all sweaty. No. Chekhov screams. He sprays blood out of his mouth. Oh. Scotty beamed his guts into space. No way. <laughs> Hey man, where are you going? You're you're missing the best part. <laughs>